I cannot reiterate enough how important it is for you to show up like this as opposed to like this. I want to nitpick you because these are the details that really matter, all right, when you're trying to get to where you're trying to get. Uh, look, uh, let's let's get some some feedback here about your career. This account is this your only account? Um, so I play on like actively right now. I play on two of them. This one uh, is like Diamond Four with decent MMR, honestly, and mm -hmm. the other one is Plat Two but climbing. Have you recently reached Diamond? Yeah. Interesting. So this is like in the last year. Or so I mean, you've been playing for a while. I can clearly see that you've been playing off and on for a while. Basically, I'm oh, trying to figure yeah. out. I'm trying to figure out <laughs> without sounding like a douche. I'm yeah. trying to figure out how good of a player are you, right? Like there's a difference between a player that hops into the game and makes diamond and a, and a player that's like actively playing and then like finally gets to diamond after like eight fucking years, right? Like there's a big difference. Yeah, so I, I was diamond from like season six through nine on my main account and I don't really play on that anymore. Um, and then I stopped like really on and off for like a year and a half, two years. And then um, like late last year, I started playing again and got back to diamond pretty quick, but like Usually the case every time I get to diamond, I just get hard stuck there and hard don't get stuck. Further. What do you th do? You think less than two hundred games is hard stuck? Nah, I guess it's not. It's not. How many games do you think you need to make masters first time? In one season? Yeah. Like at least one k. I'm guessing. Good. Okay. So how close are you to getting to one k games? That you see what I mean? Yeah, I'm far off. That's true. Yeah, I mean, I'm with you and we're going to, you know, we're going to get value out of the session. Absolutely. But at the end of the day, you do need to understand that like monetization of, of content, like you're saying, or just hitting Grandmaster for the first time. There is a huge subset of people that have played League of Legends for a long time around Diamond, Mid Diamond, High Diamond, Master, etc. And they float around that bracket, right? A lot of these players have been huh. playing since like season two, three, four, five, six, like myself. Right, I can get to master at any time. I did it this year with like fucking 50 games. So the point that I'm trying to make is that in order for you to offset the 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 the, the rank the, or the or that or the work that people have put in, you're gonna have to put in a lot of hours yourself. Otherwise, it's probably not gonna happen. Yeah, at least initially, because sure. there's muscle memory and like little mind game fucky shit that you've got to get a handle on when you're dealing with players of higher skill in this game. Because, you know, the players that are higher skill in this game, they've kind of seen it all, you know? They know they know yeah, a lot. Fair. They know a lot about the game, whether, you know, whether natural or, or just like macro stuff or otherwise. Like, <clears throat> there's just little, little nuanced spots where they'll get value that you won't. What's likely going to happen today is that we're going to find some spots where I tell you to do something that's a little, a little weird or a little aggro or whatever. And at the end of it, it's very important that you understand that what we're trying to do is we're trying to get a collection of those. And the only way that we're going to get a collection of those is you're going to be grinding, my friend. Yeah. Right? That's what I'm trying to get. Honestly, I think blue's better here. It's too late now to swap. Okay. But it does, it's not yeah. the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. My logic being that they don't have any sustain. You have to just get on people if you hold tab. In most situations is going to be, like, even Draven, like... I highly doubt that this guy tanks it out with like sustain without a support that actually has sustain. Does that make sense? Yeah, that, that's fair. Do you recommend I start blue or a red buff? So in this game, uh, I'm playing towards top. I'm not going okay, anywhere yeah, near bot. Yeah, I'm not going anywhere near bot. Well, it's Draven bot lane. I'm yeah, not going anywhere near not, bottom. No ball. Um, you can five camp, and if top is like ungankable for some reason, you can path right back down to bottom. There's no rule that says we can never gank bottom, but it's an Ezreal Zillion. Like, what are the odds that we go to two v three and actually get a kill here? Like, it's probably pretty. Yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, he ends up dominating. Yeah, it feels like a two v three that we just wind up losing anyways. Uh, I think I invade a lot here. Invade? Okay. I think about it, yeah. Should I smite this? Uh, no, no, no. Hold your smite. Use your refill. Yeah. The idea is that you have pry on both lanes. Oh, oh okay. Wait, yeah, wait. you definitely invade. Check her camps. Check her camps. How much? How much? Or, or her uh, CS. Check her CS. 16. Okay. Not really sure what's up here, but we can definitely peek stuff. Maybe Gromp? 
She couldn't have cleared everything, right? Oh, she did. She just did a weird route. Okay, that's warded. The bottom of that. Do we go for this? Yeah, I flanked that shit. Flank like through here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's perfect. Right. Mm, I don't see you know, play there. No? No. You you think you kill? I don't think so. Uh, Azir, leave, bro. Uh, reset. She gets scuttled there. There's no stopping it. Okay. I could have played that better. I just flash out of it sooner is all. But it didn't make a difference, really. Alright, your grump will be up soon. I feel like I maybe could have killed, but obviously Bell would have just come and Well, I, it just feels Kelly. ugly. Lux has barrier often, right? Yeah. Does she not have barrier? True. No, she had Kelly. CP. I mean, oh, smite. Nice. Ooh. Nice, 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 we... nice, nice. Okay. Okay, that's good. Dope. Good. That's, that's dope. Flash. Just keep farming up. Yeah, I would go up. I think I would go wolves. Um, wolves. I, I don't think Lux used anything. She didn't use flash or anything. I'm top is doing top things. LVF's gonna back and go probably towards a full clear. So what we could do, I you know, I quite like the idea of just clearing all the way up the top and then doing a lane gank to, to block whatever happens up top. But with him backing, it depends on what he does. My idea is that Belveth just goes top because she has nothing else to do. She okay. could go mid, I suppose, but I, I just feel like Azir should never die to it. <laughs> Okay, never mind. So Darius leaves. I would go and uh, sweep into top because that if the Orna gets lazy and doesn't ward, we have a gank right here. Okay. And plus, sweeping just stresses him out, and then we can take a reset if there's no option. Cool. Because Belvas gonna be topside, but I really want a two v two. Yeah. Uh, it looks like the word that was here died. All yeah, right, I would sweet. I would probably wait a second and then walk wait up. Out. And I'm walking up now. He's going for the grab. Darius has no grab. All right. Well, uh, you definitely get a gank. Bell so, here. yeah. Darius does not get six off of any of this. The fuck is his levels? What are his levels? Huh. So confused. Wave was moving. We gotta watch it back. Could be a bad call by me, but I don't really see how he's not six in the middle of that fight. All right, let's go to bot to scuttle. Mid dies okay. too, ma'am. Darn. I knew Belveth would be top, but I really wanted the two v two. Hold tap. Did the Darius have flush? Used. After we did our okay, like crab, yeah. Yeah, I like taking crab away. Yeah. Get your get your gromp first, so we get six. Okay. Oh great! <laughs> right great stuff. I think we have to try to make a play bottom now. Okay. Yeah, let's go for it right now. Now that we're six, this should be free. Go on in, bruh. Okay. Nice try, Ezreal, but... Okay, well, the wave's in a shove, good spot. Please. No, 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 no. Oh my god, Zillion. That is not a good shove. Uh, yeah, we gotta go for it. You gotta do it now. Yeah. Bell, that's top again. Should I go fuck with her jungle? Yeah, I would. Draven has to back. Oh, oh Darius nice. finally doing it. Okay. Gaming. 
That's weird. That's weird for a 2v2 to go so bad and then he 2v1s anyways. Uh, check mid health. You haven't got health bar info there. Yeah, I would path right up there and look for something. Oh, okay. Well. Mm. Is it worth it or should I just get wolves? I don't think you kill her. See if she walked up. No, I might have just entered. You don't die. She doesn't have enough damage. Sweet. She might ult you here though. She might ult might be back soon. Just so you know. She's thinking about it for sure. Go to wolves. You have smite to live. You're fine. She might throw it. You need to kite up. She might throw a. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. She's a little out of line there. <laughs> I have six. I have ult in two seconds. I like this idea. <clears throat> Wave crashing. I like this idea. Try not to show right away, though. Try to work your way around. Yeah, because. Belveth's going bottom. Yeah, let's go me. for this. I didn't see you. Okay. Belveth went into your bot side, anyways. She just used Q. She's dead. Nice. I like the idea. Or uh, Orn might come for you. <clears throat> Maybe. Yeah, just be careful. He's going to ult you. Yeah, yeah. he's going to ult you. That's fair. I don't know if you can do this or not, the chickens, but he's not going into your chickens. Okay, should we recall? Yeah, I think so. I want to do them. Can we finish these without dying? Uh, yeah. yeah. It feels all right. Yeah, we got it. Easy. Yeah, and then we just go to red. I want to get our, <clears throat> our Sunderer on the map. Yeah. 400. If we back now, we're never going to get oh, it. Less. It's going to take forever to get it. I got my boots. Yeah, you're going to have Sunder at 11.30, which is pretty good. Camera to top. Uh, I don't think we're countering it, but I just want to know. I'm not, I'm not worried about it. We, we don't want a fight. It's good. All right, let's got get ghost. out of here. Yeah. I had her. heard. It's good. What does she have? Guys going full. Just get one of these in a pink. What's going on. He wins that. Mm, he misses E. That's what happened. Yeah. <laughs> so mad. Well, that's uh, what's going on here? Yeah, let's go. We got to go around, go around, flank it, flank it, flank it. Q over. You got to get there. Yep. Go all the way around quick. I'm queuing right over the wall on the whole thing. Can't wait. Damn. Uh, I could have queued. I could have queued last second. Oh, well. Mm. I don't think it would have changed much. No, it doesn't change much. Nice. He gets out. <laughs> Draven's OP right now, man. Champ's pumping. Yeah, he's crazy. What do you think about double stacking on control wards? I, I just think I don't need another one. It's like a waste of gold, right? It, you would buy two if you have a huge lead, but right now it's kind of an even game. I, okay. I don't like it. I would have hopped over to wolves first, to put the path first? down. Okay. The reason why is because your ult will be up around the time you finish Gromp. You can start moving towards bottom. Got it. You'd be present for a play there. Normally I would do Gromp second when I'm pathing down like this. The reason why yeah, is because be you're at... Forward. Well, no, well that, but because you're closer to both options, mid and bot. Oh, I see. When I take blue last. Yeah, yeah. Should I still look for a bot? Yeah, hell yeah. This guy follow, follow, yeah, follow him, follow him. Come through lane. No. Try to sneak in and use your sweeper. Careful vision. Sweep. That's fine. 
His ears down here. They may not be paying attention. I'd wait. Okay. Uh, what's going on up there? Yeah, you've been uh, back up. She's gonna eat it. She's gonna eat it if she has any IQ. Get in the alcove. Get in the alcove, dude. Alcove. Okay. She didn't eat it right away, but she might still. Okay. All right, now you can walk up. Man. Do I want to take this? No. How the fuck do you get hit by a knock up as Ezreal, dude? <laughs> Can't do anything here. Watch that one. Shark. Oh. Dude, this Draven's oh, on fire cool. with these fucking ults. Guy, yeah, this guy's gaming. <laughs> every time every time he throws an ult, he gets a kill. It's just wild. This item's pretty good here. Would you recommend me re uh, finishing this second or going for uh, caps? Or Oh, nice. Got a solo kill. Mm, versus this, you're going to need steel caps. Okay. Um, yeah. There I'll you go. finish that off. Yeah. That's good. What is our team Wolves? doing here? Oh god. Yeah, we got wolves. They're gonna get double killed. Oh, if I had ult, possibly. They're probably drag, but there's nothing I can do about that, right? No, you give you, you give that and you take chickens and go into his top side. Okay. If you can even finish it fast enough, this guy is pretty big now. Yeah, maybe we just stay on our side and take red. Try to work with Zillion and maybe set something up. Nice timing on that. Let's follow Zillion. Let's play off of him. Maybe we can do some sort of weird 3v2 shit. Weird 3v2 shit might be really good here. Invade. Assist ping the, the Zillion and invade. Yeah. Try to cheese this guy. Okay, he's in mid. This guy's, this guy's in. Yeah, 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 that's fine. We just need to come up with something because... Okay. We're, we're, we're uh, bleeding out right now. Bell's headed to me. Going for a steal here is probably never going to happen. So yeah, you just got to do golems. I wish I had more options for you this game. I think now in mid, we've got a... What is that? We've got a Draven. Lux bottom. Recall? No, nah, set, up, set up something here. Set up something here. Okay, well, not anymore. It's not. Kai back to Darius. Hey, you just sh you just shit on him. Good job. <clears throat> yeah, we play this out now. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Lux is bottom. This is a two v one. Cool. Nice. Good win, uh, dude. Should probably take the top tower, right? Yep. Surprised how well Vi played into that. I thought she might lose that with how fed this guy is. Dude, that's why I like the lethal tempo. Yeah. This this rune's nasty in my opinion. All right, press speak. Yeah, good choice. Do I just head blue or? I wolves think I would go. Or... I would go wolves and try to get alt first. Alt first. Alt first. Okay. You're gonna need alt before you make any reasonable stand, anyways. All right, we take blue next. Nice. Looks like they're gonna reset it.
Is it good to draw my pink here? Huh. I don't think I would now, knowing that he's there. No. That's a good spot. Alright, Kim, we're on mid. We need Ezreal here first before you go big dick. This is warded all day. This has to be warded. Yeah, you're out of line here. The way you checked it was the reason it was out of line. You checked it like there was no yeah. chance they would ever have vision. We need to um, we need to reset our health here. We can't do this. Just got to be more careful with the wards we can test. I get pickaxe, which is nice. Dragon's up in 55. Do we want to contest, I think hold tab. Possible? The question is, is it possible? I'd say not really, but maybe we can make a pick before. Sweep. Sweep and flank. Draven's by himself. You got Lux there in mid too. This could be huge. No. No. I mean, you do have a zillion ult, so like, if you see something you like, I'd say swing, swing for it because you have the zillion ult after. Play your pink ward, maybe. Might be the answer. Zero's going top. This dragon's over. Yeah. Out of here, unless. Oh, this is good. Ooh. Nice. Are we losing drag to Draven right now? Is that what's happening? Feels like it. I think yeah. So. Yep. Go, go, uh, chickens, red, golems, everything. I mean, you guys are making some reasonable, uh, steps forward. Okay, well, this guy's trolling. And then that. <laughs> Take scuttle after this, actually. Have yeah, you should not have. That might fuck you later on scuttle. Yeah, I don't know if we can get it now. Yeah, we should have held smite and then hop back of the wall and take the scuttle that way and then come up the golem. So it's an awkward pathing. Base? Yeah, they might be going for Baron, but we can't do anything about it anyways. Get the, oh, not that direction, buddy. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Would you What's recommend third? I don't... I'd certainly stopwatch. Yeah. I'm big stopwatch like guy. Oh, this guy needs to die. I mean, yeah, he's big, but he'll throw. True, true. These guys throw a lot. Which way do you uh, recommend? Uh, I think uh, here, if you go bottom, you lose dragon bird. often. Or you lose Baron, I mean. The Baron, for sure. I think just trying to stay out of vision and look for picks is ideal. Maybe play off of Dr uh, Darius since he's doing big things. He's backing right now, so clear vision. Keep your eyes darting around for stuff like this Lux, yeah. They're gonna bear in here a lot. Get to try bush. Get to try bush. Mm -mm, try bush top side. This is ping ping that you need vision. Wiggle around a lot. You could be on vision. Yeah, we're gonna have to guess soon, but not yet. You gotta let it breathe. He needs wards. Camera, camera, camera. All right, let's do, let's steal this shit. Ready? We're stealing it. Yeah, hey. my man. Good work. Oh my oh, she fucking gave me the free god! Fade away. Oh my <laughs> god! Get out! Get out! You have a stopwatch. Oh, Don't forget. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You're still good. Can we win this? We got a. We got a zero on flank. You still have stopwatch. I think we can win this. Stopwatch. Don't forget. Nice job, dude. This was the best play it. I've seen in a coaching. Really? <laughs> this is like the cool. I mean, it was a good combo. It was a good steal, and then it was just the coolest fucking play. I was like, so dope. <laughs> fucking Baron steal into an alt out on just like pure chance. Seriously. Wild.
That was dope. And you get the stopwatch off. So cool. What we'll do now is we will take this tier two. I would recommend running the bottom and trying to, to greed a bit or just clear bot side completely. That's, that's a good option too. they've done that for me yeah, just keep moving it's all good because we want to we want to try to get ga and so we got to get all this shit done the good news is you should be able to crash this wave without getting in trouble for it wow everything spawns as soon as you cross it what a joke yeah whatever oh i missed that take your bot side you're greeting for ga you need to how much gold do we yep. need yeah just just cruise for it yeah. You get 50. Yeah, you get, yeah, you get 50 off that. It sucks because I want to leverage Baron, but like at the same time, it's very important that you have this GA for the next fight. Just what a joke. We can go to bottom and push for that. I don't think you get caught ever because you have flash Q. Their bot lane's going. Yeah. I'm pretty strong. I don't want to leave like I don't want to leave our team and like split push Vi here, but at the same time we might have to because of the way that the map's working right now, right? Keep going? Yeah, I keep cruising. You can uh, see Belvath, you can see Lux, you see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you press B, press B quick. Oh my god, QA. He's going to be an asshole. QA, he's going to chase yeah. you to Narnia. Fucking tank. My uh, death stance told me. <laughs> yeah. That's Bye pink. Good. This would be a two pinks timing right here this would be that time? yeah 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 because you're like late game vision's very important for picks right you're pretty fed now after the baron steal all right so i i think what i would do Make sure you get a pink in the pit. You need a pink in the pit. Like, none of you guys have vision control right now. Like, it's ridiculous. There you go. Should I pull it? Mm, you can pull it out, yeah. Make them come to you. That's good. Let the let the that dragon hit, hit them. That's cool. Yeah. So your pink, the way, way that, you placed it should always be in the front of the pit. Okay, you have a GA, so we could definitely get shit done here. Darius is resetting. You have GA though. You have a zillion alt as well. Oh my goodness. That was a good Yeah, bomb. keep going, keep going, keep going. Alright, that's probably good enough. No, no need to drop GA. Yeah, let's just bail. Grabs it. Holy shit, what the fuck did damage to you at the end of that? That was weird. Oh, it was a death stance. Alright, so yeah. Gromp. I think what I'm feeling here is uh I probably go Maw. Because if, if you hold yeah. tab, you'll see that there's a uh, a pretty substantial amount of magic damage coming down. We got the MFs yeah, harassing you that. with with this bullshit E with Lee Andrews. We've got Orn uh, magic damage, and we got the Lux who's always hitting us. We didn't really get much value out of the Baron, but that's not our fault. Kind of a weird situation. Yeah. Oh. That sucks. Back. Yep. Just got to get our... We got to build towards Hextricker Maw, yeah. Oh, nice. He killed Bell. Another pink. Keep him. Multiple pinks now. We're at right that on. stage. Yeah, you're big. You got to be... Uh, yeah. Hold tab. We got Baron in a minute. Your goal now is to make sure to not die. Like, just don't randomly die when Baron's about to spawn or it gets scary. Okay. Push one and then kind of chill. Yeah, I think I would set up vision on Baron and try to start, like, clearing vision and shit. You still have Belveth dead. These guys can't feel great about being near you, so. Yeah. Like, pick the pit. Yeah, pink towards the back of it this time because your team's able to defend it. Like the like near the back of the pit. That's good. Jared walking up to that. You're fine. I, I don't think they're going to contest. Velveth just spawned. 
Is there a play in mid? Look at where Orn is. Yeah, I'd be thinking about it. You guys have a very, very fast Baron take. This Belveth has not proven that she can smite for shit. So, I would be very, very tempted. Orn is still split off, or was. Careful. Darius is bottom. Orn can rotate. Uh, yeah, just help with Baron. That's a good idea. Yeah. Because the way that he's doing it is smart. Now you're tanking and like, take this, this yeah, fucks with them, right? Yeah, we just. I wouldn't even reset yet with Darius down there. If Darius wins, we got to push. Darius two v one. Okay, so, mm, kind of shitty. This is a four v five here. Um, yeah, go for it if you want. They're split still. Yeah, I think so. I think it's fine. You have the GA. Yeah, I think it's fine. Nice. I still maintain it. Yeah, I think um, it's whoa, on you. Whoa, whoa. You have no flash. I'd let your team do the work here and see if they land poke and just kind of show face. Just like chill. Now you, you got to be near them so they don't engage. You got to like hover and just be annoying. Yeah, even if you're not going to do anything. This way, if they engage, we are going to leave. It's like a bluff call if they go for it, right? Yeah. Yeah. You can take your chickens now and heal up. This could be good. Mm. Camera, camera. Uh, I'd leave. Yeah, I just bail. Oh, quick pick. Nice okay, job. She's yeah, that was anting. that was not it. Yeah, that wasn't it for her. Um, check check drag I timer. Yeah, check drag timer though. One minute. Sh you shove mid. Help shove mid so they don't get caught. Mid. Then you can reset and we'll get it. We have to block drag. Yeah. This is good though. Another pink. <clears throat> Double pink. Now this time your ward needs to go in the front, like the mouth of the pit. That way they right can't there. take it like last time. Yeah, because last time you put it like towards like on the pit, but you need to really aim it and think about whether or not they can contest, like from what angles they contest, right? Because yeah. you need that vision. Like you need to know, you need to know where their wards are and all that shit. That Lux is top. It was just free. Now you guys have like a quarter Baron left. Let's go bot assist being bot and move. Confident, confident. You you will engage. Like you you want to engage. Like if you see somebody, yeah, you want to engage. Yes, absolutely. Oh, yep. Lux teleport. Now Lux TP. We still can engage. Uh, Lux just use bind. I dive. I dive. Hundred percent. I go under. I go under. I don't even think about it. Yep. With, with fucking GA behind? Absolutely. Oh. See that? See that shit? That's the cleanest right there, bro. Go to mid, mid to end, mid to end. Mid yeah, mid. mid, yeah, yeah, it ends. Now the question is, would you have dove there normally? I would not, no way. Yeah. That's my problem. <laughs> oh, I think you played well, man. This was good. Just some adjustments. Like I said, adjustments, adjustments. Right? Yeah, yeah, for sure. <clears throat> so a couple things I want to go over um, to really get you thinking about, like, planning. So the one okay. was the Baron Steel. Because one thing that I'm very, very deliberate about is getting junglers in the position to steal before shit hits the fan. Now, what does this mean? Well, Belveth, enemy team. Belveth is always going to push for Barons. Their team has a big AD carry, which does objective damage. You know, they have the traditional, like, death ball comp. Your first responsibility as a jungler <clears throat> is to pick spots where they don't know you're there, okay? So that's your first goal as a jungler. Um, okay. So what I really... The reason I'm pulling this back up is because one of the things I fear... I You know, I don't know. I'm just making assumptions. Common mistake that I see players make is they'll set up somewhere around here, around here, or, like, you know, just, like, really obvious angles that don't mean shit, right? Yeah. What I want you to think about when you're going for steals, I want you playing in here, playing in here, looking for steals on these angles. Okay. These are very powerful spots because no one ever wards these. You're going to see it happen it. right here. Okay. Watch. No one ever wards try. Watch. 
I'm calling it without even knowing, by the way. Because it's so common. See, both spots I labeled? Yeah, nothing. They don't even know you're going for it. Look, you just show up and go for it on their screen. Look how clean that is yeah. in hindsight. Right, all they see, this guy's not even stressing right now, look. I cannot reiterate enough how important it is for you to show up like this as opposed to like this. Yeah, that makes yeah, because if I was there they would They change they play totally different. It. They play totally different. Draven yeah. ease you when you're charging up. Like there's so many things that could happen here. Belveth knocks you up. Orin like slams into the wall and knocks you up before you jump the wall. Um Lux probably goes for a Q. You see where I'm going with this? Yeah. Enemy team should be Lux E needs to go in here. Um, someone needs to ward this, usually, in my opinion, if you're not accounted for. But generally, it's never going to happen. Bonus points, if you want to be real sneaky. Hide here for a bit. Like, obviously, in this instance, we kind of... I want to just... I want to nitpick you, because these are the details that really fucking matter, all right? When you're trying to get to where you're trying to get. These are little things that yeah. give you small win... Like, basically, small win rate edges over time. So we knew, I told you, you're going to dance around in here, right? And just wait. A good little move is to actually just stand here for a second. Because okay. again, just if in, someone... Just in case it's warded. Yeah, just in case. This way. And then you, you were waiting for a ward anyways, right? Remember. Yeah. So once the ward gets in, you just start charging your Q, turn the corner, and, you know, do this. Make sense? Okay. Yeah. Um, so, so say, for example, um, they never put that blue ward in the pit. Would I have even tried it and guessed or... Yeah, you guess. You just swing it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you just. Okay. You're eventually just gonna roll your eyes and say, "Fuck it." Same well, way. because the 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 logic. This was such a huge moment. You're down three drakes. You're down about six k gold. You could pretty much deduce that we're losing this game pretty hard right now. I think. Right. Yeah. That's why. Much. That's why I rated this play as like probably one of the best plays I've seen in the coaching because it's just a really good steal, a really good time steal. It's a huge gold swing. Like, there's value in this play. Like, a lot of value beyond just like, oh, he stole a Baron. Like, sometimes you steal Baron doesn't mean shit, right? This is just yeah. a really good Baron steal because it's it's going to swing so much. Um, and then you guys just clean house off of it. So it's just a massive play. The big thing here, though, that I, the reason I'm bringing this up is because I need you as a jungler seeing this shit in advance. Because remember, I steer you to Tribush earlier, right? Yeah. And my fear is that you don't do it normally. Right. Not all the time. Sometimes I do, but I think that's if teams already um, where I'm at right now on the screen. But yeah. If I if moved you not, there would... so in advance, right? Like, yeah. I was like, dude, go in to try like now, because as soon as that pick happens, you can figure out they're probably going to start Baron. So the mini game and I, the why I'm going over this again is because I want you to recognize when we're in the mini game, right? The mini game is now Baron. <laughs> <laughs> right? This Baron minigame. Yeah. And it, as soon as you identify that someone's dead and your team's all over the map, you know, Azir's bottom, you need to get the fuck out of vision near the Baron. So because I had you slide over right away, you dodge vision right away. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. That was close. So I'm just letting, I'm letting you see that these details matter a lot and just... The positioning is why the steal is so good. I would bet a lot of money that if they saw you, you would not have stolen this. <laughs> like, yeah. I'd bet a lot on it. Now oh, for the yeah, dive. Team Draven. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they weren't aware of you. And basically, it's object permanence. I use this term a lot on streams. They should know you're up and that you're there. You theoretically, it's like, it's like if it can happen, it will. You're here. Vi is here. That You see what I mean? But notice how mm -hmm. none of them take any steps to prevent tragedy. None of them... But like I said, Lux never once throws an E in here, does she? You don't see a random never. ward. You don't see a random ward. Even a bad ward, like I've been in this position. Even like throwing a ward here, you never see anything. So this yeah. team fails because they weren't aware of you. But if they saw you, the dynamic changes. Because diamond players aren't, you know, they're, they're diamond players. not fucking dumb. But, like, if you stay out of their vision, yeah. they can be dumb. And this was pretty dumb by them to not check anything. So, uh, the next thing I just wanted to cover real quick was the dive. And, you know, this ends the game here. 
it's really important that you see why it's ending the game. So first thing you see is Lux split off the top. And everybody's kind of split and staggered. The big thing that you need to remember, GA is not a defensive tool. It's an offensive one. Yeah. All right. So that's how you need to think of GA. GA gives me an excuse to int. So in this case here, I was yelling at you. I was saying, hey, we're going in like we just fist pump send it. Right. Once the pick happens, like you said, you probably never go for this dive. That's a good thing because that means that's an adjustment, right? That you can make when you're playing. Yeah. Look for these checkmate moments. The reason it's such a good mo moment to go for it. We saw Lux top. This is an outer, but this is a tier two, right? It's a side lane mm -hmm. tier two. You've got a pick on the misfortune. You've got a GA. And not only that, your team may not have a huge wave here or anything, but there's just no universe where they can ever fight outside of their base here. And you've got GA. It's like, if it's wrong, it's not a big deal because you're just going to flash Q out. Right? Yeah, that's true. Gosh, my <laughs> level is so high too. That's what I'm saying. Relative to everyone. Yeah. So here, I'm just like, dude, send it. Don't even think about it. Just go. What happens when a team refuses to give objectives is this. Where the enemy team should have, or what they should have done is they should have scrapped this turret long ago. Higher elo players. Uh, yeah, if we're talking like, you know, master GM challenger, not always, but they should be here as a four. Mm -hmm. On the back half of the tower, accepting that you guys are going to take this tower. Because they refuse to give you the tower, they play right into what we want. Right, which is just a full-on bait at this point. I mean, it wasn't even really a bait. It was just pure stat diff at that point. But my point is that you could have just tanked everything into the GA and you still get the same result here. Your teammates have nothing to do but to follow you. Yeah. Right, they have no other play. So your, your uh, Baron Steel sets us up. And then, you know, we close out the game here. So they gave us the money back. We played smartly until we had our GA. And then we got our next Baron and then just put the game away. Those types of plays, the best time to do it is when you have a Baron like this. Okay. You know, they go outside a tower, outside of inhibs. It's a really good timing to go for it because if you kill, if you kill them, it's just you're, the game's probably over. So that's the time to swing yeah. or sling Richard, as I say. 